Hi, this is Reggie with Stupid Racings. In this video, I will show you how to make a thumbnail in Final Cut Pro. I'm going to share with you a simple way to make a thumbnail using built-in tools in Final Cut. So let's get it on. Go over to your clip and find the best part of your clip and then click to lock the playhead. Then hit option F. We now have a still image to work on. You can now delete the videos right here and right here. Okay, let's resize our video or our image. Right click and then transform. Drag the blue corners like so. Drag. Let's drag it to make it a little bit bigger. Right here, right here. Now let's add some title. Go to title browser and then search for basic TI. Now drag it to your timeline and let's trim our title. Now double click our title to change the text. Let's make it Y. FCPX is the best. Let's put the is the best at the bottom. Enter. Let's change the alignment to left. Let's make it a little bit bigger. Let's drag it on the left side. Let's change our font to Bebas. Make it a little bit bigger. Drag it all the way. Adjust the line spacing right here. Drag this arrow. Okay, that's about it. And then let's drag it more, a little bit lower. Oh. Okay, and then let's put a little oomph. If this video has been helpful to you, go ahead and hit that like button. I would really appreciate it. Let's put some FCPX logo right here. Drag it to your timeline, then right click and transform. Let's rotate it a bit like that. And then let's resize it. Drag the blue handles at the corner right here. Let's move it towards here like that. Let's make an export settings or export template. Just click the share button, add destination, double click save current frame, change the export to JPEG, and then double click save current frame. Let's make it export to JPEG. Hit enter and then close. Click the share button again, export to JPEG, click next, save. Now let's go over to our desktop to see our thumbnail hit spacebar look at that great job i bet you like it thank you for watching i hope you learned something today but if you want to learn more i've made another video about how to make a gif in final cut click here to check it out